in Chengdu, the international capital of gourmet, hot pot must be the top choice for food in the minds of foodies. Hey guys, it's Jeremy from Chengdu Plus. So right now I'm at Chunxi Road, which is located in the busiest shopping district of downtown Chengdu. Right behind me, you can see there's a very special bus. It's actually the newly launched hot pot bus in Chengdu. Or you may have taken a bus, but have you ever had hot pot while taking a bus? Today I've invited a friend of mine here, Vida, Hi, to join me. I'm Vida. Let's try this hot pot bus together. Are you excited? Yeah. Let's I'm do so this. Excited and so hungry. Let's, Let's go. go. You can see that unlike any other regular bus, the seat layout here has been changed so people can sit face to face. There are a total of 8 dining tables inside which can accommodate up to 20 guests. So Vida, do you like hot pot? Yeah, actually when I just came to China, first place, first restaurant where I have been was hot pot. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. That's a special place, special food of China, of Chengdu, so actually uh, I really enjoy this meal. And we're inside this special bus, and you yeah. can see the surrounding decoration is red, and everything is bought with hot pot. It's oh, like, that makes sense. That's right. why this place calls hot pot bus. <laughs> right, hot pot bus. In a moment, they're going to serve us with the hot pot. Oh, you're kidding me. Right, right. We will eat hot pot in the bus. Right, exactly. That's, <laughs> that's uh, cool. That's what's special about this bus. After 10 minute ride, our bus arrived at the restaurant where the staff were bringing out hot pot dishes. Each set of meal costs 89 yuan and is enough for two guests. Mm. Alright, let's see what's I'm inside. So excited. <laughs> so many things. I'm already too hungry. Right. Even the smell of this hot pot makes me feel, feel dizzy right now. <laughs> dizzy? Yeah. And everything is already cooked. You don't have to use a stove or anything to cook it. It's very convenient. That's so convenient. Let's check out what's inside. Oh. It looks like there are a lot of tofu and potato. So they prepared well. <laughs> they prepared well. They, they made a balance. Right. And this. Um, oh, how do you say this? I know it's Chen Yeah. <laughs> it's a stomach like thing. Thousand, thousand uh, levels. What it calls in English, sound <laughs> level? <laughs> Thousand layer stomach. Right. <laughs> Hot pot was also known as gudun soup in ancient times because of the sound when the ingredients are put into boiling water. It is a cooking method whereby a pot is used as a utensil and water or soup is boiled to cook the food. It is an original Chinese cuisine which offers warmness in winter and appetite in summer. Among them, the spicy hot pot in Chengdu is famous all over the world for its spicy and mellow flavor. The history of Chengdu hot pot can be traced back to at least 1700 years ago. Hot pot is placed in the middle while people drink and eat around it. As early as Western Jin Dynasty, Shu Du Fu, written by Zuo Si, had vividly described the scene of Chengdu people drinking and eating hot pot around the table. Actually, during this trip, I have seen we passed so lot of hot pot restaurants, so many styles, so many kinds. Why Chinese people so like hot pot? Chengdu or Sichuan is in this basin area, so the climate is usually humid. Interesting enough, that this spicy hot pot or the spicy paper can help people expel this dampness in your body and they can just regain this energy. Actually, you just remind me, once I visited a um, Chinese medicine doctor right. and he said, you should eat more hot pot right. because it will help you to get rid of the sweat and humanity from right. your body. Exactly. <laughs> As the first hot pot themed bus in China, this bus journey starts at 7 p.m. every day with an extra 3 p.m. round during weekend. Starting from the busiest Chengxi Road, 
the bus will travel past Chengdu landmarks such as Lankui Farm, Wangping Street, 339 Tower before finally returning to Chunxi Road. In order to ensure smooth driving, the speed is at a stable range of around 20 km per hour. The whole journey is about 10 km and the travel time is about 60 minutes. Why there are so many styles of hot pot in Chengdu? I think loving food and loving to have fun is definitely top two to describe the personality. Definitely. And this is just it's imprinted in our DNA. I'm so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now that we have finished the hot pot, uh, how do you feel about this trip today? Actually, I'm absolutely satisfied. I have seen so many beautiful places. I eat it so tasty hot pot and I did it at the same time. <laughs> That's amazing. Taking a bite of spicy food while enjoying the beautiful view. I think the comfortable life in Chengdu that people are craving is nothing but this. The hot pot bus can help us not only feel the unique lifestyle in Chengdu, but also experience a unique hot pot culture in the international capital of Gourmet. In the future, Chengdu will also introduce a series of attractions such as Tea House Bus and Sichuan Cuisine Bus, featuring alcohol, tea, dishes, and other regional elements. Let us together feel the life in Chengdu. <laughs>